health affects your overall health. Studies have found that the same bacteria in your teeth can lead to heart disease. We are joined by dental hygienist Jody Baranato and Laura Smith, who are going to be performing oral cancer screenings at the Be More Healthy Expo this Saturday. So you want to make sure you get out there. Ladies, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks, Thanks for having us. All right, and we've got you standing because you're going to come give me an exam in yes. just a second, aren't you? All right, well, explain, first of all, when we say your what goes on in your mouth affects your overall uh, health, how does that work? Well, when you have an infection in your mouth, you know, periodontal disease, which is basically gum disease, mm -hmm. part of the body's reaction to fight that disease is to pull blood into the mouth. So, and the gums are very vascular. So all that blood that's kind of going through to fight the infection goes throughout the entire body. It's pumped through the entire body, and that bacteria can then rest into the heart, which causes heart mm -hmm. disease. It can also rest in the placenta, which is also a big risk factor for a pregnant uh, women that they can have preterm or uh, birth or low birth rate. So when you all screen, do these screenings at the at the expo, what is it that you're looking for? What is it that you can uh, help people prevent or, or you know, uh, take care of? Well, we can definitely look for signs of oral cancer, which we would want to then refer to an oral surgeon to do a biopsy, okay. because that is definitely a serious condition. But we can also look for gross decay or cavities on the teeth. And then we can also look for puffy red gums, which would be an, a sign of gum disease. All right, well, and it's quick and easy. I mean, yeah, it, this absolutely. is not, you know, a lot of people are afraid of the dentist. I, <laughs> yeah. I, I am one of those people, I have to say. <laughs> Um, so this is not something that um, you know people need to worry about. Show me okay. kind of what you're going to okay. be doing there so people get an idea. And if you wouldn't mind just kind of explaining what it is she's doing and what she's uh, looking for and sure. what she's able to see. See, she's putting on all of the equipment. That's yep. what makes so me nervous. In <laughs> infection control is No, it's, it's good and it's necessary. <laughs> there we go. Got some hand sanitizer there and some gloves. So what we're doing first is we're going to be palpating or touching the outside of the face. Okay. Um, we want to make sure that we're not feeling any lumps or bumps or anything um, that is there that shouldn't be. You oh, have a lot relaxing. of... Yeah, it is. It's like, it's, see, <laughs> going to the dentist is fun. No, this is how you suck <laughs> us in. <laughs> I'm going to go right up And then here. we're okay. also checking the thyroid. For me. And we're checking underneath the lymph Perfect. nodes. Okay. So even though we are dental health professionals, we are looking, remember, to the total health because your oral health is related to the rest of your body. And we were talking in the mm -hmm. commercial, it's never too early to get started. I mean, this is Children's Absolutely. Uh, yes. uh, so, Dental yeah. Health Month. February is National Children's Dental Health Month. Okay. And it's really important to spread awareness about that because, um, believe it or not, early childhood cavities is the uh, most chronic common uh, disease in children. It's actually five times more prevalent than asthma. And, and how it's early is too early? I have a daughter who's turning one on Sunday. Well, and happy she's birthday. Teeth. She's we got are... 18, so. <laughs> yeah. So the first tooth actually erupts at about age six months. Okay. So the ADA is now recommending that they get their first visit by their first birthday. Oh, it's wow. never too okay. soon. So there's a lot of uh, important information and things that we look for at that, that right. first visit. She's got a doctor's All right. scheduled <laughs> next week. All right, so back to my exam. So, yeah. so we're going to look inside the mouth. Okay. I'm going to let right. you do all the talking now. Absolutely. But. So it's important that we look towards the back of the mouth. Believe it uh -huh. or not, it's not just smoking and drinking that can cause oral cancers, it? but actually the ah. HPV virus now has been <laughs> showed. So that's why it's important to look all the way back okay. like you're at the doctor's office. The sides of the tongue, uh -huh. underneath the tongue, are the most common areas. And so just from that, you can tell someone enough to say, maybe you should get this yeah. looked at, if maybe something you should look, check out. Absolutely, if something looks wow. suspicious. Okay, mm -hmm. there's no drilling it, involved. Yeah, it's very it's easy, <laughs> very well, easy. Actually, no, that's useful, so. Yay, <laughs> yeah, I like this. We're the oral healthcare prevention specialist. Okay. We don't want you to be in pain, both in adulthood and early childhood. So and neither sure that, do yeah. dentists, I know. It's, you know, <laughs> it's the babies yeah. like me. Um, very necessary though. Thank you so much. Easy Thank screenings you. that can be done. Make sure you get out to our Be More Healthy Expo. Make sure you stop by uh, the dental hygienist booth so they can give you an exam. If you want to learn more, log on to our website, foxbaltimore.com slash morning. Well, make sure you do mark your calendar because the, the expo that we've been talking about is coming up quickly. It's this Saturday at the Baltimore Convention Center and admission is free. All right, well, coming up, eat some good food for a great cause, of course. After the break, we're going to see what Bill Batemans has to offer while helping muscular dystrophy. Look at all that. Of course you're gonna eat wings for muscular dystrophy. 8.51 is the time. You're watching Fox 45 Morning News, all local, all morning.